one of the things that I'm trying to remind people of, we are part of the collective, we are part of everything. And we really need to start looking here for any conflicts, whatever conflicts we have. When I went, I'm very fortunate because most of the time I spend my time with people from within the journey and we all have done so much work on us. So we're not walking around being upset with this, that and the other and gossiping and blaming. But what I'm hearing and seeing so much at the moment, especially is that people obviously, I think, must feel fear or some deeper emotion. And the first thing they do is project it outwards and blame somebody else. So there are relationship issues. And in that kind of 10 days that I was away, I just met people, day-to-day -day people that aren't involved in personal growth work. And I could see this everywhere. So and so did this and so did that. And I thought, wow, at the end of the day, I thought people really need to start to resolve issues within themselves. And we have a hashtag, it starts with you. If each and every one in the world would clear up, tidy up inside first our issues that we haven't been able to forgive, but actually find a way to forgive. The forgiveness is never about the other person. The forgiveness is about us letting go, us letting go of an issue. But if we could do that, if more people could do that, our world picture will be a reflection of the individual. But at the moment, we are a reflection of what we see out there. And what we see out there is natural disasters. We see war, we see conflict everywhere we look. And I just wish and pray that people can somehow find their way to clearing up, clearing out, coming to wholeness, coming to forgiveness. And then this is a ripple effect that can go out. And I think that can change what is happening in the world. So I may be a dreamer. And if I am, so be it. But I can only just shout it from the rooftop and say, please, if you have an unresolved issue, if you have something that happened in the past and you can't forgive your mom or you can't forgive your dad or your uncle or your sister or your friend or whoever or your ex, bring that story with you. Come to a, one of these weekend workshops. Bring the story with you. And I absolutely am certain that you will come to completion, to wholeness and to forgiveness. And that this is something not only for you, but it is also something that will ripple out in your family, in your community, in your circle of friends.